to the Backseat Directors. I'm Bastian James, and I'm joined as always by Zane C. Weber. That's me. I'm Zane C. Weber. I like movies, and I like talking about movies, mm. and I like talking about movies to you specifically. And I'm also here with Dozer. Yo, 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 it's me, Dozer. The end. Yeah, yeah. That was it. That was it. <laughs> yep. I was so distracted by his movie. <laughs> you guys want to roll into some games? Yeah. Yes. Let's do it. Absolutely. I shockingly have nothing prepared what? except for my winning personality. So this is all <laughs> on you guys content wise. Okay, let's do uh, let's start with Alex. Alex, okay. Alex has something for us. I do. I have a cheeky game of hmm. quotability. How cheeky is it? Like oh, it's a little bit cheeky. Mm. 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 I don't know. Oh. I mean, how R rated are we allowed to get with this stream? I'm not taking oh. anything off. <laughs> um, I'm just going to right. put it there. All right. Well, let's see if yeah. Twitch bans us. Yeah. Like, okay. will I blush? I guess is the, is the question there. <laughs> like, am I going to get a little bit, a little bit upset here? Let's try it. Let, let's yeah. try and make yeah, Seb uncomfortable. Me, idea, okay. Let, let, let's tuck straight in. <clears throat> All right. Your first quote is just confirm yeah. you're telling us quotes. We have to guess the movie, right? Correct. Let's do it. Yeah. <gasps> Maybe we should do it the other way around and I'll guess the movies and you tell quotes. <laughs> No. I'm not no, sure that would work, but and, maybe we'll try that yeah, next no. time. <laughs> maybe off air uh, we can. <laughs> no, okay. So your first quote. <clears throat> On your tombstone, it should read, always in the wrong place at the wrong time. Hmm. This isn't cheeky. This is mildly threatening. I was, I was expecting something a bit more, you know. <laughs> Risque, punchy. In a world, Go is on. it Sin City? It is not Sin City. <laughs> Wait, well, uh, Panache. Is it the spirit? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, thank God. <laughs> that would have made me blush. It would have. <laughs> no. Okay. Um, your next quote. <clears throat> um. Oh, hang on. Sorry, I lost it. I was really. I was looking at it, then I lost it. Okay, sorry, it's a um it's a bit of a back and forth. You know, chicks dig scars. Really? Not that one. Um Panache. Is it one of the it films? It like is not. It chapter one? No. No. So chicks dig scars and you on your tombstone it should all it should read always in the wrong place at the wrong time. Mm-hmm. This makes me, that first one makes me think that it's a sequel that like they've got the team back together and is like, oh, you've done it again, dude. Um, yeah, I've got nothing. I've got nothing for this one. Okay. Deb, no? I guessed it. Yeah. No, it's oh, right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Next one. The news is completely manipulated. Everything you hear every single day is designed by corporate media to do one thing only, to keep you living in fear. See, that makes me think that in the chat, probably a real human's guess is very incorrect. <laughs> I'm not going to say it because I've never seen that film, so I couldn't reasonably guess it. But um, <laughs> yeah, no. is, is it, it is it like yeah. the new uh, um, studio uh, studio sixty three or whatever it was that kind of the the movie that was the precursor to the newsroom no. TV show? No, okay. No. How far uh, off genre wise uh, am I? Like one hundred percent or like fifty percent. <laughs> uh, I guess Joe's. I'll ask. You can see the stream. Is mm -hmm. it by chance the TNT the Wrestler Best of Volume Two DVD um, <laughs> that I'm pointing at? Is it that one? No, because I've never watched it, but it's there. It's, it's not that. Film. Are okay. you just bragging about what you've got in your house now? Is that what's going that on? That is not a brag. Okay, <laughs> that is a a humbling statement <laughs> that life is filled with traumatic things, including the best of TNT Volume Two DVD. All right, let's okay. go to the next one. <laughs> so your next one, I'm gonna, they're going to start to get a little bit easier now. If you've seen, please. It. Okay, <clears throat> my. 
Oh, yeah, little Asian chick, likes to kick people. I don't think she's going to be talking to anybody for a real long time. Last time I saw her, she was at the bottom of an elevator shaft with an SUV rammed up her ass. Oh, in a world. Zane. I can't remember what number it is, but this is this is the Die Hard movie with Justin Long in it. I need the name of the film. Yeah. <laughs> so it's not Die Hard 2. And I think they stopped being like numbered after that. Is it like um I never think the second one was numbered Die Hard 2. <laughs> For sure it is. It's Isn't Die Hard and Die Hard 2, wasn't it? Any parts die Hard? I think um, Die Hard 2 is Die Harder. Oh. And was it so uh, I'm just gonna get is it like live free and die hard? Is that this movie? Oh, you've nailed it. <laughs> I don't think I nailed it. Like I really crept up on that one. <laughs> um, yeah. you know my, my guess was going to be V for Vendetta with the media one, which I yeah. also have not seen <laughs> and was well, just speculating. Um, <laughs> yeah, look, probably close. Um, <laughs> but my last one, which I was hoping, like if you didn't get it with that one, was going to be you just killed a helicopter with a car. Yeah, that that definitely would have got it. Bullets. <laughs> <laughs> that could be any movie but that's, that sounds oh, like a, that sounds like a matrix movie that's a willis line if i ever heard one <laughs> all right all right do you have another all one right I, I do excellent it's significantly harder oh good <laughs> your favorite yep. i know i know um okay i need to get rid of this i'm just getting into my, my my peaceful okay. place here i just it's fine what Everything's is your fine. peaceful place <laughs> Anywhere like? else. <laughs> like <laughs> I'm doing that happy place thing from Happy Gilmore. There's lemonade. There's dresses. I don't know. I mean, you, you joke, but legitimately my happy place is a cinema. Oh, well, there you go. Yeah. I think mm. mine's a room, but it's like a quiet room. And so like a cinema? I mean, it's quiet though. It's oh, like there was no movie playing. <laughs> Yeah, like an empty cinema. <laughs> that is that, that is my jam. Um, all right, sorry, Doze. I hope that I was enough stalling for you to find the thing. Yeah, no, no, yeah, it's all good. Um, so I'm going to go from a particular line of quotes. I'm going to give you one at a time. Wait, so this is like a segment of dialogue from the movie, and you were just going to progress through it? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yep. The first quote. <clears throat> this is your mother's throne, your grace. In a world. Zane. Uh, The Princess Diaries? Negative. (laughs) Fine then. (laughs) I'm I'm struggling to think of any movie with any royalty in it that I have seen. (laughs) Like I can name a bunch of movies of like, yeah, royal people in it. Yeah. Your Um, Highness. mm -hmm. (laughs) (laughs) Mm-hmm. No, no guess from me. Okay, next quote. Have you come to save us, Clara? Clara. 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 I don't know who that is. Yeah, I've got nothing. I can't remember a movie oh. with... I can remember that there's a movie with Clarice in it. <laughs> it's not Clarice, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, nothing. Okay. All right, the next line. Yeah. Yeah, please, please. No, I'm sorry. I didn't even know this place existed before today. You see, I was looking for a Christmas present from my godfather. Uh, Panache. Yes. Uh, Chronicles of Narnia, Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. Negative. I was looking for a Christmas present, did you say? Correct. For my godfather. Again, yeah, I've got nothing. Yeah, my godfather. Yeah. I mean, Chronicles of Narnia, you're kind of getting sort of in the same sort of realm. Yeah. But no? No. Yeah. Okay. Your next line. Please. Oh, I love Christmas. That's <laughs> what that's like. <laughs> Pass. <laughs> <laughs> no? Okay. Same character. What's Christmas? What? Oh, I love Christmas. What's Christmas? Uh, is it like a Disney Lilo and Stitch straight to DVD special? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> 
I feel like I'm learning a new language. That specifically, <laughs> this is my first lesson, and the teacher doesn't know it. <laughs> no, I have no guesses. No, okay. Um, continuing it on. But I've then the throne line, honestly, but that's the part that's really yeah. We kind off. of like mentioned a throne and then just like went off sideways. <laughs> it's all in one scene. Yeah, I, I don't know what to tell you. Um, <clears throat> okay. Then I ran into this homeless mouse, and that's when I met the captain. Oh, that's ringing a bell. You think that would help, but I'm further away from where I was previously. <laughs> Can you say it again, sorry, Doris? Yep. It again. Thank you. Um, Then I ran into this homeless mouse, and that's when I met the captain. So it has to be animated. Like a homeless mouse? It's animated... Unless it's Stuart Little. My guess is Stuart Little. If you the scene, I have no idea. It's, In a world. Is it Zane. Stuart Little? It is not. Is it Mouse Hunt? It is not. Mm. Okay. Throne. No. Pardon? Don't forget yeah. about the throne. We haven't. We are grasping <laughs> at other characters. <laughs> all right. All right. This next one might help. <clears throat> we barely escaped Mother Ginger and the Mouse King. Uh, mm, in a world Zane Is it uh, an American tale? It is not Ah, oh, damn it Mother Ginger and the Mouse King? Is that the characters we just dropped? Yes I have no flipping <laughs> clue what we are talking about Oh, really? I'm not, even, not even close I'm surprised Zane hasn't got it yet, to be honest <sighs> It's it's, the, the, it's ringing bells, but like again, like this, uh, I can't remember the one with any, anything with Christmas in it. <laughs> Sorry, Mister Red Claw, Castle, Clara Cloft, Clone Ray Plater. <laughs> At least you got the name in there. Yeah, like he's doing better than I am. I, <laughs> only Clara I can think of is from Doctor Who, which is very unhelpful. Right yeah, now. it's it's definitely not Doctor Who. Okay, I will keep going. Yep. Um, you met Mother Ginger? Oh my dear, Clara, you're very lucky to be alive. Okay, so this talks of mice. A Mother Ginger is obviously a cat character. Am I right? Like, I'm guessing I'm seeing anthropomorphic animals here. I guess my question is: Is there a movie about a human queen in which their cat, who is a pet, is like? queens or kings of the cats like is there a story about an animal who's like the second to a human royalty i'm gonna give you a hint it's nothing like that (laughs) can i i mean is this i don't look i don't know of any movie i can't name any specific movies but it it is Mm -hmm. is it is it an adaptation of the nutcracker because that's got the mouse king and mother ginger right is it aristocats it is not Aristocats. Damn it. <laughs> Zane is very close. Okay. Oh, I, I mean, I've got nothing. All I can say is like Nutcracker. I don't know any movie. I can't like name any movies, movie versions of the Nutcracker. Oh, um, okay. Maybe unless maybe Barbie and the Nutcracker or. Uh, it's, it's not Barbie. He would not do that to us. Surely. <laughs> I would not do that to you. <laughs> All right, next quote. Let's quote. Let's get this. Okay, let's uh, let's get this. Okay. You must promise never to go back to the land of amusements, Clara. Who is Clara? Who is this? <laughs> um, uh, Cinderella. No. Dude, I've never seen it. I don't know. I'm just guessing films with animals that talk in it. I assume there's talking <laughs> animals in that film. Uh, in Cinderella, yes, there is. There is. Yeah, well, okay. I assume that Swan talks or something, and there's, there's a Swan. There's a yeah. there's a food to the Swans. I don't know. No. Okay. Um. Okay. Moving on. We're almost to the end of this whole thread. Oh um, no. <laughs> okay. So I'll, I'll I'll give you a couple in a row just to give you yes. a bit more context. All right. Okay. So please. Hawthorne. Its title has been restricted. Oh, of course. I meant the fourth realm. Apologies. I'm just so upset. 
Oh, I was going to guess this before. I've no, I've once again shocking. Haven't seen it. Is it Golden Compass? It's not. Is this bears? Is it? Is it? Is it the Nutcracker and the Fourth Realm? It is. <laughs> what? Yeah, it is. <laughs> Okay, I made that up because I was just saying the Nutcracker and whatever you're going to say. A, what is the name of the movie? What? The Nutcracker and the Four Realms. The fuck oh. is that? You can't just make up a movie. It's not made this up. This isn't like Doza tests his screenplay. I legitimately thought Zane might have seen it. And because you look at obscure things as well, I thought there was a chance you may have as well, Seth. I was going to look this up now. I have no idea what this is. It's from 2018. Yeah. It's got that dude in it. Oh, that dude. You know, um, um, Morgan This is Freeman. absolutely a straight to DVD movie. It's got Kira Knightley, Helen Mirren, Morgan Freeman. This is no, this isn't real. <laughs> it is. Uh, no, it's. I absolutely haven't seen it. Really? Um, <laughs> no one saw it because it's I have figment. seen it. I have seen it. <laughs> Good. How, All right. How, okay. Well, I'm happy to. Cl- I'm happy to claim the point <laughs> by Good mashing idea. together words that you said <laughs> <laughs> into something that resembled the title. So neither you. you, you oh, it yet. is neither Disney. No, 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 absolutely not. I haven't not. heard of it. Uh, and even now talking about it, it's <laughs> there is I've got nothing. God damn it. <laughs> the fuck is this? All right, well, let's let's move on. <laughs> All right. I have is a game. Like Kira Knightley's not in movies anymore. She did this <laughs> and they got blacklisted or something. I don't know. I mean, look, it's still Disney. So can't be that bad. I mean, for for a career. Five and a half. Okay. Exactly. Oh boy. Okay. All right. I have a game. This is a game that I have not discussed with any of you prior to this. And (laughs) I love these games. So, this is a game called Score as Lowly as You Can. Um, Okay. Well ahead of you. (laughs) I want you to take it in turns guessing movies that are on the top 10 grossing movies of all time, but not. Globally, not in America, the, this is their Australian gross only. Ooh. So uh, I'm going to think of a number between one and ten. Dozer, what is your guess? Seven. And Seb, what is your guess? Six. <laughs> My guess is nine. So Dozer gets to go first. <laughs> Seb, do you want to go first? Or- yeah, I'd love it. <laughs> what are we doing? I'm so lost on the game. Yeah, so basically you've got to give me the title of a movie that you think is in the top 10 Australian grossing movies of all time. Now, so when we say Australian, we don't mean it had to be released as, as like an Australian original film. Are you just talking about how no, no. that film grossed Any in movie country? that grossed yeah. in a, gro- gro- made profit in Australia. I'm just going to go straight for the top two and say Titanic. Okay. I'm going to give you, uh, basically you're going to score the ranking and the person who scores the lowest wins. I will say Titanic is on the list, but I'm not going to tell you where. Ooh, Avatar. Okay. Avatar is on the list, but I'm not going to tell you where. Hmm. Uh, Avengers Endgame. Is Is on the the list. Yeah. But I'm not going to tell you where. The Shawshank Redemption. The Shawshank Redemption is not on the list. What? So I'm going to give you 11, 11 for that. <laughs> Dang it. Toy Story 3. Toy Story 3. Not on the list. So I'm going to give you 11. Ah. <sighs> So are we aiming to get number 10? No, you're aiming to get the lowest score possible. How many times do we do this? Oh, so, oh, I thought we were trying to work out what the last one. I'm with you now. Okay. Yep. Cool. I'm with it. Yep. So we're going to go until you get the, the movies or until I call it, basically. <laughs> until we get the shame um, spiral. I will say, it. like, all of these movies... You you sh- you should be able to get them. Like they're very well known movies. This list isn't too different to the overall grosses of all time, but it is different enough to make it interesting. So, all right, well, your turn, Doze. 
in Australia. Okay. Yep. Um, oh. um, what was the one before Endgame? Infinity War? Yeah. Is on the list. Hmm. And I'm actually because you're having you because you're struggling. I am going to tell you where where these are. So, Titanic Seb was uh, ninth. So That's lower than I thought. Wow, yeah. ninth, ninth highest grossing <clears throat> movie in Australia of all time. Avatar uh, Doze was uh, number one. Aye. Uh Avengers Endgame was number four. <laughs> Uh, Seb, the yep. Shawshank Redemption was not on the list. Yeah. <laughs> uh, whatever Seb said was also not on the list. And uh, Infinity War was number seven on the list. Mm. Right. So, Seb, so throwing back to you. Well, critical acclaim doesn't always obviously convert to box office claim. That being said, I feel as though at least one of the Christopher Nolan Dark Knight films would be on the list. I'm going to say, even though two was more well-received, I'm going to go for Dark Knight Rises because it may have had the boost from the fact that two was so well-received. Dark Knight Rises is my guess. Very well thought out guess, but unfortunately not on the list. Damn. There is, I will say there is one more uh, comic book movie, and I will give you a clue that it is a Marvel one that is on the list. That, but only Ooh. the Avengers and one other. Oh. Civil War, not on the list. Oh damn! Yeah, my head's immediately been screaming Spider Man two I mean, this entire time, but <laughs> I know that that came out so early in the mm. pit that I'm going to go Black Panther. Not on the list. Hmm. Yeah. Good wow. guess though. Like the, the <laughs> these are all uh these are all close, but they're not yeah, they're not on the top ten. Jeez. Um I will I will give you the clues. Like think of big movies that have come out recently. There are not many there are not many movies on this list that aren't from the last five years. All right, so No Way Home. That is on the list, and that is number five. That is the only other comic book movie on the list. All right. So no more comic book movies, which is fine. I can work with that. Movies that would have done well within the last five years. Say so there's a there's at least one Oscar winning movie there, uh, but a lot of a lot of like. Box office smashes. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to go Jurassic Park World. Jurassic World, the, I think it was Diminishing Returns, the first one, just Jurassic World. Not on the list. Okay. Mm. What other movies? <laughs> yeah, what other movies exist? Can you give us a brief rundown of. of yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll give you one more clue. And if you <laughs> think Disney. Ah, uh, yeah, right. Disney's produced most of the ones that you haven't guessed. Yeah. Uh, let's go the Lion King remake. Yes. Yep. That is number six. Oh, jeez. <laughs> that is one of the highest <laughs> grossing movies in Australia of all time. Everyone <laughs> of all time. The I, the movie I, with. Buttholeless cats. <laughs> I haven't seen it. Hmm. Back to Seb. <laughs> Thinking, uh, I know it's you said more recent than not, but keeping in mind Disney, I'm not even sure if it counts as full Disney or not. I still, I'm, I'm on the Toy Story bandwagon, man. And I'm thinking if we're talking more recent, it would have to be four. But I also think that two was super successful and there are still some older movies like Titanic on there, but also Titanic mm. destroyed the box office. I'm going to go against my instincts. My instinct says two. I'm going to say Toy Story 4. Not on the list. 
Is this bullshit? Yeah. <laughs> this is rigged. Australia <laughs> has weird taste. I'm going to put it out there. Like we 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 do like most of what the other the rest of the world likes, but we like it in a weird proportion. <laughs> uh, there, there's a couple of here on here that I am very surprised at. Um, so I, I think we'll, we'll give, uh, I, I guess, Doze, if, if you're comfortable, we'll let you make one more guess and then we'll we'll call it and and, and I'll go through the rest of the list with you. Yeah, okay. Um, oh, all right. So we're still thinking Disney mm-hmm. and we're still thinking animated. Mm-hmm. I mean, I say, I have no idea. Um, <laughs> um man, uh, it's gonna be like one of the Star Wars ones. I actually legit forgot Star Wars existed when you're doing this thing. <laughs> I know I just said animated, but it's it's gonna be like. I don't know, The Force Awakens. That's the one I would have guessed just for yeah. your record. That's Force Awakens is number two. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. 90, 94, <laughs> uh, 94 million in Australia. God. All right. All right. So number one overall of all time, Avatar. And we'll wait and see whether they do it again with Avatar 2. I'm not going to see it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, we're reviewing it. That's a joke. I would never, I would never do that to us. Another four-hour movie. Yeah, that's uh, what we need. That's what the uh, people wanted. So number two was Star Wars: The Force Awakens. Now number three is one that shocked me: Top Gun Maverick. Uh, of course, people love that film. That this actually, year, I heard a lot of weirdly good things. Yeah. Um, I no, saw I it. it yeah. It's just the old movie with faster planes. Hey, that's pretty good. I assume. Mm. Nice. Mm-hmm. Sure. Uh, <laughs> number four, of course, was Avengers Endgame. Number five was Spider-Man No Way Home. Number six, The Lion King. Seven, Avengers of fin- Infinity War. Number eight was Star Wars The Last Jedi. Uh, number nine, Titanic. Oops. And number 10, of all time, grossing movies in Australia. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Can, is, yep. this a, is this a weird one? Is that what you, are you building up because it's strange? It's a weird one, yeah. Oh, Crackerjack released in. I wish it was. I wish it was. Um, or the castle or something. But no, this movie was released in 2018, grossed over $55 million in Australia, nominated and won several Oscar Oscars that year. What genre is this film? Musical biopic. <laughs> what year did you say it came out in? 2018. Is it Bohemian Rhapsody? Bohemian Rhapsody. Yeah, I was like, number Jesus. ten. That, that is a. Sh- I mean, I don't so hate weird. that film, but it, it was, that's it was a good a film. Plot, but, but um, okay, cool. Yeah, weird. it was just just weird. Like there, there's huh. there's movies on that list that are just not what I would imagine would be on that list. So yeah. okay, yeah. yeah. Wow. Okay, so who won? That well, was won. by a landslide. Doze. You. Oh wow! <laughs> uh, Seb Seb got uh, two of the movies on the list. You got five of the movies that were on the list. Oh wow! Um, so oh. yeah, yeah. So 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 I did. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, there, there's a number of uh, fun fun little lists here that I've got that I might hold back for for another day. But yeah, that's yeah, uh, cool. top top ten grossing films in Australia. And maybe I'll just pick a different nationality and we'll do the top 10 grossing films in Japan. I feel like we're going to hit a a really big trend where it's just displacing the top five throughout the list. (laughs) Sure. (laughs) All right. Well, I think that's us for another episode, right? Yeah, absolutely. Mm. Nice and fun. How do we sign out of an episode? I know we've done it twice tonight, but... um, I mean, check out the Twitch, check out our social media, yeah. uh, and let us know what kind of games you'd like us to play. If you've got an idea for a great game, uh, send it through and we'll play it. Yeah, absolutely. Um, that's, that's how we say goodbye.